Hey guys, it's Leslie, and I'm excited because I have a giveaway today. I've kind of shied away from giveaways because, you know, everybody starts contacting you, and then you get so crazy, and you get backed up, and I'm already backed up enough, so. Um, but my girlfriend, Natalie, over at Hot Off Garlic Press is the, like, spokesperson, recipe creator. Um, I think her title is... Um, kind of the culinary department. I don't know, Natalie. I'm sorry. I can't remember what your actual title is. But she is associated with Shelf Reliance. It was a company that started doing, um, like, shelves for uh, emergency food or, um, um, like, freeze-dried fruit and stuff for emergency purposes. You know, that would sit on the shelf for years and, like, 30, 50 million years and not go bad. but still have the quality ingredients there. So, um... Now they have this wonderful line of food, freeze-dried fruit food, and she was kind enough to have the company send me some food, and I must tell you I am in love with what they sent me, um, one being the freeze-dried pineapples. Now, I must say that I have only rehydrated or reconstituted one piece of pineapple because I keep eating them all. And I have one, three pieces left, and I thought to myself, oh, good God, I better do this giveaway before I um, run out of them. <laughs> because I wouldn't have any to show you. If you can see that, oh, good God, you see this hair? This is called Florida humidity. Nasty. Anyway, um, pineapple. And it is delicious. Let me, mm. you hear that crunch? Let me tell you. Last night, because now I only have two pieces left, I had to order a big old tub of them. I don't know how I don't remember how big the tub was, but I think it was twenty three dollars. But let me tell you, that will be my snack from now on is those pineapples. And another thing they sent me was freeze dried um, strawberries, equally as yummy. And I did rehydrate these, and they're delicious. But again, right out of the package, delicious. And um. All the packages have these recipes on the back. Not all of them. The pineapples don't. But the strawberry does for a strawberry marble cheesecake. Delicious. And they also sent me <clears throat> some Thrive corn. Mm -hmm. Haven't used it yet. Um, instant milk, which you just um, mix with water. And it's like milk. I mean, it is milk. But, um, and whole egg. And that is what they sent me. And... Um, you know, some people are really fanatical about keeping food storage, like my dad. He has a hurricane closet in his house because we live in Florida, and it has, I need to turn him on to this because it has, like, you know, the nasty um, pork and beans and all the gross kind of food. But if he had dry food, then mm, he'd have good food waiting for him if a hurricane came. Um, so, I know I have pineapple stuck in my teeth. They, um... Thrive and Shelf Reliance, same company, but Shelf Reliance is the name, and Thrive is their food product. Um, they want me to do a little giveaway, and I was happy to do it because I'm in love, love, love with their products. Not for the whole emergency purpose of the product, <laughs> but the um, the deliciousness of the food. I mean, and they only sent me a couple. <laughs> my little helper, and they only sent me a couple things. I want to try the dried mangoes. Mm. Like I said, I will. <laughs> I'll just eat it straight out of the box and never even use it for cooking purposes just because that's how good they are. Um, but they want to give away a raspberry cake bar fruit. I mean, wait, let me start over. No. Raspberry cake bars gift basket. And in the basket, there are pouches of, I have to read off my list, white sugar, butter powder, whole eggs, white flour, freeze dried raspberries, a recipe card, a mixing spoon, and a mixing bowl. It's a $20 value. Not so bad. Um, and it is all the makings to make their raspberry cake bars. And I'm sure they're delicious. I'm not sure if Natalie came up with the recipe or not, but if she did, you know, it's got to be good. Because if you've never been to her blog, Hot Off the Garlic Press, she has some scrumptious stuff going on there. Um, so, goodness, I've been long-winded today. Um, the contest will end on Friday, and I will have the links below. It's kind of like um, the Brady Bunch, you know, looking around at all the people. Okay. So all you have to do is subscribe to their newsletter, 
and I'm sure it's not, you know, we're not going to email you daily, but um, <clears throat> subscribe to their newsletter and enter the contest. Let me know. Leave a comment letting me know that you subscribe to their newsletter and, you know, and we will um, go ahead and give away that gift basket so you can make these yummy strawberry cake bars. So go ahead and do that and the contest will end on, um, <laughs> the contest will end on Friday. You're crazy. Watch my daughter. Wait, let's see if she can do it. Wait, I can't see her eye. Can you see that eye? <laughs> she can. She can cross one eye and leave the other one not crossed. It's bizarre. <laughs> all right, so go ahead and subscribe to their newsletter. I will leave all the appropriate links. <laughs> I think she's so mean to be an actress because she is so dramatic and so funny. <laughs> um, where was I? This is just a post all over today. Um, the contest will end on Friday. Subscribe to their newsletter. Go to their site. All the little appropriate links will be at the bottom of this post. <laughs> so good luck. And don't forget to visit Natalie's post, Hot Off the Garlic Press. And I'll also put a link to her blog, too, because she's my girl. All right. Have a good day. See you next time. Bye.